I'm going to show you an infinite credits glitch using ship duplication. The more you're willing to put in, the more effort, the more you're going to get out. Now I'm going to have in the pinned comments Kibbles Gaming, who if you want to find out how to min-max this, you make the perfect ship for this, he has the guide. I was planning to do it, he's beaten me to the punch, so I'm going to just link you to him. I'm going to explain the basics of how this glitch works and how you can do it at a lower scale if you would like. So this is a very basic ship. This is the Razor Leaf. And what I've done is I've taken off the fuel tank on the back, took off the shielded cargo, and I just added some tanks here. Now, what you can do is once you've made a ship that is mostly tanks and mostly landing gear and the thrusters required to make it work, whatever it takes to get the ship going and make sure you have a core of a ship that's very noticeable, very visible, you can find. You go and you need to duplicate that ship. So for me, I'm going to duplicate this Razor Leaf on top of the Rambler 2. So on PC, you can go ahead and press T and B at the same time. Let them go at the same time and possibly duplicate. I have very bad luck with that. So I'm going to use a controller. And in this part of the menu right here where you're looking at your ships in the modify section, I'm going to press R, B, and X at the same time using a controller. And I'm going to go ahead and take any of these engines here, and I'm going to move them. And I'm going to do that. And as you can see here, I now have a second razor leaf, and you will notice right there that fuel tank has been moved. Now what you're going to do with your second ship, and again, if you're wanting step-by-step -step how to make the perfect ship, Kibbles Gaming already did it. Go into the ship builder. So for me, I'm going to go right here. And what you're going to do is double tap another part of the ship. And you're going to hit control. And you're going to click through all the parts of the ship that you want to keep. That you don't want them to be red. Anything red, we're going to get rid of. So you can do that until eventually the only thing red is is going to be, let's say, a few fuel tanks like this. What you can then do, once you have just your fuel tanks, you can do all the fuel tanks, is you're going to hit the delete button. And you'll notice there that by deleting those tanks, I got 8,436 credits. If you min-max a ship, you can delete all the tanks that are extras and get yourself 160,000 credits per time you do this glitch. So you can actually empty out the entire vendor, then you would go to Venus, you would rest for six hours, either in a, um, a bed or a chair or in your ship. You'd wait six hours on Venus, and then you'd come back to a vendor to do this. So if you want to do that, that's up to you. And then that resets. And then let's say I take that, I finished it, accept it. Okay, so this ship is now less than this ship. What I can do is I can repeat the duplication. And I can go over here and I can take this and move it back and back over here. Cost me nothing to do the duplication. See there, my timing was off. So we'll uh, do it again. We move this over. And now you can see here, I have that last row of the, um, the fuel tanks back that I sold. And you can infinitely create these parts over again for free. So the idea is basically you have a core ship with added components that are expensive. Now, I've tried a few things. I've tried seeing if I can like glitch fuel tanks inside of each other, which I can, but then it says they're not connected, even though they are connected according to the game and all sorts of weird stuff. And another issue with this particular glitch is if you don't have the high, high level for shipbuilding, you can't do this as well. Uh, you can't get as expensive parts. But this is going to probably be the fastest credits in the game for the current patch, unless someone finds something else. Um, again, shout out to Kibbles Gaming. I literally sat down and was like figuring out where ship parts were and how to build the most minimal ship. And I just happened to think, I'll check and see if anyone else has already beat me to it. He did it. A fantastic job. Check out his video. This is just the basics and to let you know if maybe you're interested in it. You can do this. Also to show how if you want to do it at like a lower level, you can. Hopefully someone found this interesting. Um, and if anything, I just want to make you aware of the glitch. I know some people don't follow everyone.